The Ash Minority Recruitment Initiative is an important initiative for recruiting and retaining individuals from underrepresented minority groups in the field of hematology. And I think it's important that any individual from an underrepresented minority background who's potentially interested in hematology know that ASH is there for them. And in particular, our Minority Recruitment Initiative is specifically there to help support them all along the way. So we have opportunities for them to do research, shadow hematologists to get a better idea of what kind of patients do you see. And if you're ever in a bind, you know you can always pick up the phone. We're there to help you succeed in your career as a hematologist. The concept of the longitudinal pathway really was developed after we had initially created the MMSAP program for medical students and then the ASH AMFDP program for mature individuals who were already in an academic position. And the whole goal of the, the Minority Recruitment Initiative was to not just recruit people but to retain them in the field of hematology. A medical student is very early in their career as a physician and uh, there are many pathways that they can take. And so the whole concept of this longitudinal pathway was to provide more opportunities for exposure to hematology to enable trainees at various stages to be able to engage in hematology research. So the whole spectrum of uh, training levels is what's behind the longitudinal pathway. So a medical student goes on to become a resident, a resident then goes on to become a fellow, and a fellow then goes on to become uh, a subspecialized physician if that's what they choose to do. One of the unique aspects of all of our programs is that they provide dual mentorship. So each individual who's awarded one of our various awards is paired with both a research mentor and a career development mentor. And the research mentor oversees their project, helps them troubleshoot, whereas the career development mentor is available to help answer any concerns they might have about career, uh, give them career advice, and uh, sort of follow them through their entire career. I think mentorship is very important. We all need role models no matter what we do. And in particular, in medicine and in science, there are very few underrepresented minorities. And part of having a role model is seeing yourself being similar to someone else. And so I think mentorship is very important. And particularly in uh, fields where there are very few underrepresented minorities in terms of sort of helping individuals negotiate a pathway to a certain career. We also have all of our awardees presenting at the annual ASH meeting at the uh, Promoting Minorities in Hematology reception. And it's very impressive to hear medical students just completing their first year of medical school presenting their research. They're very articulate, very poised, and it helps, I think, build confidence in students and also helps build professionalism. In addition, we have a luncheon at the annual meeting and that luncheon enables our awardees to network with each other, to build community, and to meet leaders in the society and leaders overall in hematology. And so th those are very unique aspects of our awards programs. I think it's really important that we have a hematology workforce that reflects our population. Hematology in particular is a very exciting field. And as hematologists, we're really the leaders in medicine. There's so much on the horizon, so much to be excited about, that I think that you know maintaining a diversified population of uh, physicians is really important in, as we pursue advances in hematology. Our overall vision is really that we want to eliminate healthcare disparities in hematology by inspiring younger individuals of underrepresented minority backgrounds to um, pursue and succeed in careers in hematology or related fields.